massive competition. What's up, Money Geeks, Mr. V here. Welcome to another video, guys. So in today's video, I want us to take a look at ticket symbol B-I-G-C, Big Comment. But before we get started, if you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So if that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. So guys, before we actually really jump into the video, uh, I wanted to take a second here and just make a huge announcement. Guys, we hit 5,000 subscribers here on the channel, which is um, unbelievable. Like, um, I don't know what to say. It, I mean, 5,000 subscribers, like, that's, that's huge. Maybe to some people it's not, but to me, man, that's massive. Um, just to, to get that interaction, get the questions from you guys, and just that, you know, back and forth and just helping each other grow. That was my main objective of the channel to kind of show people that if you knew nothing about investing, uh, you can go from zero to uh, becoming a, a profitable investor like myself. And, and that's why I just wanted to share because I knew there's a lot of people out there that maybe have their $10, $20, $30 a month that don't know what to do with it and they're putting in a savings account. Uh, not knowing that you can invest that in the stock market and get some great returns. So uh, from the bottom of my heart, I want to thank every single one of you subscribers, guys. You guys are, are the real, real money geeks here. Um, you guys are putting in the work, um, asking the questions and just learning and growing and continue to uh, build wealth. So that's awesome. So um, I know people usually do some giveaway when they hit uh, huge milestones. So um, I don't know, what I'm gonna do is just leave a comment in this video, then I'm gonna select three random people and just um, send them our, our t-shirts. So we have two designs right now that we're working on. Uh, one is don't be a greedy savage. If you guys been watching my video, you know where that comes from. Um, and then the other one is buy low, sell high, repeat. So you have the option to choose between those two designs. If you are one of the three lucky uh, um, subscribers that get you know get chosen for the, the price that's all I can do for now guys but again uh, thank you so much for all the support and just uh, interacting with the content let's talk about big comment so uh, big comments actually uh, you know debuted the IPO last uh, last week uh, on the Nasdaq and if you don't know a little bit about big comments uh, big comments is a it's our software as a service platform uh, exactly comparable to um, Shopify so I did a video here on the channel talking about Shopify and how I saw the potential for them growing I'm gonna hook that video up here so you can definitely go check it out if you haven't already but uh, big commerce is in the same space they're doing the exact same thing providing uh, business owners and entrepreneurs an opportunity to be able to open an e-commerce store with all the different uh, capabilities that you would need to run a business so we're talking about shipping um, we, we talk about packaging and all these other things that they integrate. They have a ton of um, add-ons or plugins that you can put in there to make your store a very, very uh, functional e-commerce store. Shopify does the exact same thing. So um, again, they're company they're competitors. Uh, for investors, if you if you missed out on the break on, on Shopify and you didn't invest in it at the early stages. Um, because it's right now trading at about ten, uh, uh, one thousand dollars a share. Um, so if you missed out on it, um, Big Commerce would be uh, what else? A poor man's version of Shopify. Um, and hopefully, who knows? Maybe someday they can rise to the occasion and start moving further and, and, and grow as, as Shopify did. But you never know. Um, again, when you we, when you invest in these stocks, you're going in looking at the potential. Um, uh, for growth. So the question that you're probably asking yourself right now is, Mr. V, um, is become it become as uh, uh, you know a buy at this point? Um, there's several factors that would go into me answering that question. So again, as you can see here, uh, B Commons has uh, the platform, a software as a service, where you can go in and just sign up and then be able to create um, your own store and include some of the, the different plugins that they have to allow you to grow your business, uh, customize your store um, to your liking and use your own um, domain name um, just to kind of get your product out there, help you with integration with social media so you can actually grow your business and stuff like that. Um, so 
Uh, again, if you know um, Shopify, this is exactly um, what Shopify does already. So, um, if you, if we are just looking at that, so here are some of the, the, the key things, again, like I mentioned, that we, I, I want us to consider when it comes to, to, to big commerce, right? Um, their, right now, their finances are not looking too good. Um, so their finances, they've actually lost a ton of money um, over the years. Um, so 2019 and 2020, they've been on the losing end. Um, and the reason for that has been, I mean, they're still trying to grow and expand. Um, so again, if that's the same thing that Shopify went through losing money. So finances and devaluation is definitely um, I'll take kind of a red flag. But if you look at most of the tech companies, they they, they do uh, reinvest a ton of their money into the company to try to to help to help the the, the company grow. So that um, again, for somebody that's looking to get into the space, that shouldn't be um, a, a big big deterrent. So. Um, again, this is their SEC filing that you can actually, if you want, I'm going to link it, link it in the description below so you can definitely go check it out and just look at the numbers uh, for yourself. Uh, COVID-19 has been a big, big help uh, to a lot of these e-commerce companies because um, a lot of people have been doing online shopping because of the shutdown. So, um, and they continue to enjoy that growth uh, throughout this period. So, um, when um, Big Commerce actually, uh, Big Commerce Holding actually went live um, last week. Um, as you can see right here, the debut, um, the stock has just, you know, gone up all the way to about just a little bit over a hundred dollars, and then pulled back. As to when I was doing this video, uh, they were currently trading at about seventy-six dollars. So um, compare that to Shopify, which is currently trading at uh, at about a thousand dollars a share. And so if you can look at Shopify here, uh, prior to, prior to um, uh, COVID, I'm struggling to find COVID. So prior to COVID, so this is the low of the COVID, they were down around $336. Fast forward that after COVID, now they're trading at about $1,000. So if you see, they even, so they even went up closer to about um, $1,100 and now pulled back to still under $1,000. So, um, yeah, so Shopify is the giant in the space. Um, they've, they've shown, they've shown the last time they show consistency in their profitability. Uh, whereas uh, Big Commerce is just getting into the space, and um, and more as more and more people get into online spaces um, to start creating their own businesses, there is potential for um, for Big Commerce. Um, are they going to match up to uh, Shopify? I think Shopify is way ahead of. Um, the, the game. So, uh, given that um, uh, e-commerce a potential and 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 that um, software as a service business is something that is growing, uh, big commerce is, is more than likely to really see some good growth down the road. But I, I don't anticipate the growth to be as much as um, Shopify. That's again, that's just my take. So, um, if if you would ask right now, hey, Mr. V, now that you've said all this. Uh, what do you think is big commerce a buy or, or what's the deal? Um, I would say um, yeah. If you if you missed out on Shopify, um, I wait for I wait to pull back again um, for for this um, even at seventy six dollars. There might be some pullback uh, on this coming, especially if things um, start to get better, businesses start to open up. This it might slow down, so you see some pullback. So I'll wait for some pullback before I would pull the trigger or. Um, you can count a dollar cost average your way into the stock. So buy a little bit and then wait for a pullback and average your way down um, into the stock. So, um, so here are you know some of the things. So these are some of the reasons why I personally would not be uh, buying uh, big comments because again, guys, as you you guys know, I am already invested in in Shopify. If you are looking to get into the space again um, I think that big commerce is a poor man's version of Shopify so to conclude this guys if, if you look at what we just talked about here um, if you just want to get into you know that space uh, software as a service especially in the e-commerce space this would be um, a really low entry point um, for for 
you know, what I'll say, competition to Shopify. Um, but again, enter smartly. Don't just dump everything because I think there's going to be some pullback on the stock. Um, and so if there's that pullback and then you can uh, dollar cost average your way into the stock. Um, that's it for this video. Um, again, if you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. And, and also, if you're looking to get started with investing, uh, we currently recommend um, Webo. And so right now, Webo is doing a promotion where you get two free stocks um, for just signing up um, and depositing $100. So definitely go check them out. Link in the description below. And don't also forget um, that we are doing our own uh, giveaway here for uh, you know this huge milestone of 5,000 subscribers on the channel. So um, all we ask is just leave a comment in this video and you are in for a chance to win um, the three three t-shirts that we're going to be giving out to uh, three lucky subscribers. So um, if you have any questions again guys, let me know in the comment section. And as always, stay motivated.